Well, sorry for making you look through the whole family photo album. Um, but it, Thailand, about a week ago, was my 50th nation that I've been fortunate enough to steal ideas from and share ideas with. And Terry Pettit talked uh, yesterday about your writing your obituary, and it kind of hit home because my record isn't in here <coughs> because my record is 10,522 to 31. And that's because I've lost 31 kids to s volleyball after I coached them somehow. And that's the biggest loss that I think we can see in our sport is when we lose kids after we coach them. Um, my grandfather was a great man. He won the French Legion of Honor because of his work in Tahiti, uh, eradicating a horrible thing called elephantiasis. Um, my dad helped a lot of people heal. My mom was a first grade teacher. So, but this is my family. I'd like to thank some of my heroes. Um, if I don't get to you, I'll blog about it later, I suppose. But uh, you know, first off, the guy that comes to mind is Mike Hewlett. You know, <laughs> Whew. how do you how do you lose your arms and your legs and still keep coaching? Um, pretty big hero. I'm lucky to be coached right now by Doug Beal, still, after 30 years. Um, he's the kind of leader at USA Volleyball that tells you where to look but not what to see. And in that spirit, I think our sport has been thriving, along with the great stuff that you see Kathy DeBoer and the staff at the ABCA has been doing, and I'm thankful for that. At my table, my oldest friend since kindergarten, a cancer researcher, way more important than volleyball, is here. Uh, <laughs> Scott Graves, and an old buddy, Ruthie, from college that does some amazing wildlife work, which is sometimes, I think, way more important than volleyball, too. But this summer, I got a chance to spend time with Carl McGowan and Susie, and, uh, you know, with my kids and learn on the court with Carl. I got a chance to work with the Wounded Warriors and the great things that Brian Swetney and the people that do these amazing things serving our country. I'm, I'm just blessed to have everybody in this room that I think is part of my you know, volleyball family. And I hope that the things that we all do together as a family um, are collaborative and work together. I'm going to challenge each other, though, in one way. And that is to never be a child's last coach. If you do that, you really have succeeded as a coach beyond your record. To everyone else that I've forgotten, Byron Schumann and Lily that do amazing things in Haiti and, and you know, Margie and all the people in regions that saw things in me when I was a young coach that I didn't see, the rest in peace Leah Wagner and all the great things that she did for our sport, and everybody else that has touched my life, I say thank you and I hope that you keep in mind one of my dearest friends, Long Ping's quote, which is, winning and losing are temporary, but friendships last forever. Thank you very much.